I mentioned Coach Parks, you know, and he speaks to the world of you. You know, what were you able to learn from not just him, but during your time over at Coastal that has you feeling like you're more prepared now for a situation like yeah. this? Um, just, just the, uh, just to play in college football. You know, I had the experience. I have three years of experience and I'm playing in college football. You know, at the at the end of the day, uh, no matter what conference you are playing in, college football is college football. So. Um, I have learned the experience and when it comes to Coach Parks. You know, he was, he was really big on route route running. Like we have to be able to run routes, no matter what, no matter if you're inside or outside. So, you know, every every day in practice, like, we would really work on routes and break points and stuff like that. Like the the little things that would make us better. For you, I mean, they they use you inside. They use you on the perimeter. They use you in the backfield a little bit. How would you describe your game for people that might not be familiar with you, might not have seen any tape over at Coastal in terms of what you could be bringing to South Carolina, what you hope to bring? I would say, you know how like on the roster it says WR by my name. I would I would put A A T H, you know, because you know I'm, you know they move me everywhere. So you know I, I'm not, you know I am a receiver, but you know they can move me in different places to what makes me happy. On the outside looking in, you know, we look at your experience, and we think that you know you could be one of those players that can help be a leader in that young room. Obviously, Luke Doty's been there for a while, but I bring that up because how do you walk that line? We've talked about with this with other players in the past that come from the portal. How do you walk that line of trying to be the leader, but at the same time, too, you're the new guy on the block? Right. How's that like? Yeah, I'm, yeah, it is. It, it is pretty hard because that you don't want to just come in and you know just think that you're running things, you know, yet like that you want to fill everyone out first. But I feel like I can lead through my play, you know, at, at first. And then if I need to say something to bring the team up, I will. But the first thing that I need to do is is, uh, is produce so, so they can um, see me leading that way. Has anything stood out to you in terms of what you were told about South Carolina that maybe you're here and it's like, wow, like, that's that's the truth. Whether it be yeah. Coach Beam or the players, whatever the case may be. Yeah, they they uh, told me before I came. You know, this is a very loving environment. You know, everyone on the team loves each other. And when I came in, you know, it was it was just just like that. Like I came in and they immediately treated me like family. So, sure, that's what around with me. Impressions of Coach Coley. Uh, I like I like Coach Co Coach Coley. He's he's been at the uh, big stage. He was at Texas A and M last year, and I think previously he was at. Florida State or Georgia? He's at both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Florida State and Georgia. So you know he's put put guys in the league. And, you know he's put put guys in the all. He's made guys the All American stuff like that. So I feel like he he would be a good addition to this team and to the staff. Special teams a very big part of this program. Do you have any plans on playing special teams? Any way I can get on the field, I'll do it. You know, I don't I don't have a problem playing special teams. You know I wish I would have played special teams more. Um, at Coastal, but um, was that was that something that they brought up with you? Obviously, there's a change in special teams coordinator, but you know, there's been players, especially the wide receiver position, over the last couple of years, and they've talked about just how much that helped them in terms of being able to play at that next level. Yeah, right. Because you know, most most scouts and coaches look at you know can they can they play special teams, and you know most of the rookies come in and play special teams anyway. So if you can show that on film now, then you know that'll go a long way.